Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. I am Mega400, and that is Gina Shupa. Here it comes. You, you'd better be ready. Oh, but he drained half of his HP from being from swimming. So yeah, because of that, this is a very, very, very easy battle. Simply because he's was stupid and swam instead of using his wings. Um, so his new skill is more power. He has wings and a spike on his head at the same time. I know you're all about fighting, so he knows that we can't jump on him, and we can't uh, use my ha our hammer. But he forgot that I have a spike shield. So yeah, you're gonna die really easily. This is gonna be a really simple battle. What? Yeah, what in? Is that even legal? It's not legal to use a badge. I can't do that. Um. So, what should I talk about? Well, um, I got a, a prior message. Uh. Actually, last week, but I haven't had time to talk about it till now. Uh, from Pawn the Great, a uh, YouTube user, Pawn the Great, um, and it was really, it was a, uh, a basically a request for um, a rant, and it was really thought out, and I really appreciated how uh, appreciated uh, you know uh, the detail he put into it, and I, you know, I thought, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll rant about it because it was actually a really good rant. I don't mind, you know, I appreciate when people send me stuff like that, you know, instead of just saying, uh, oh, rant about this, like in a really simple stance. I mean. People just in general appreciate it when you like you put effort into you know giving things to people. Like if you write a message and you put de make put detail into it, people appreciate that more than just a simple message or you know just in general. People just people by nature just appreciate that. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna be showing off getting uh, doing the letters first. This is giving it back from the uh, Red Yoshi kid back to Dainty. Um, and we'll have to give it to Frosty, who we can't do until we get to the next next chapter. Um, but anyway, uh, Pawn the Great's rant, uh, he was talking about how he, uh, really doesn't like, um, uh, like Ivy from Soul Calibur and stuff, how they're, they're really skimpily dressed, uh, and they have almost no clothing on, they're very skimpily dressed. Um, and my thought on it is, I mean, I guess the main question is, does sex sell? And I, I don't know if it, I don't know if it does, like, is there anyone I know who particularly buys video games simply because of the character design? Uh, I don't really think so. However, I will give one example that I think does make a difference. And, it's not, and I guess it does kind of have to do with a uh, uh, skimpily design, but um, Tomb Raider. I'd have to say that a majority of people who actually bought the game, and don't quote me on this because I don't know for sure, but I think a lot of people who bought the game bought it more for Laura Croft than they did for the actual gameplay. Uh, here's another letter we had for Dane, uh, for Rusty um, that we got from, I think it was on the island. Also, we can talk. Rusty will also give you some interesting hints, which I might show later. I don't know. Uh, you can at, tell me whether or not you want to see all his hints, but I may or may not. It, it almost will take up too much time, and it's kind of pointless. Because a lot of them are stuff we already know. Maybe I'll show some of the ones that we don't know, if there is any. Um, but yeah, anyway, in that case, I think it does, maybe. But in, in terms of like two dimensions, like I guess in 3D, maybe to an extent. I, I would think so, but like, um, Fire Emblem, for example, that was another one he, uh, mentioned. I don't see any reason, here's another letter, uh, why Fire Emblem, like, I don't see any reason why, th uh, designs of those characters would impact s sales. And, uh, in a way, it's also kind of demeaning, I mean, you don't see any men dressed like that either, but, um, in terms of the actual design, does it make a difference, uh, how they design clothing for women? It kind of does, personally, like, uh, if you want to show off certain features, you'll have, um, I'm just showing off this scene, you can meet Goombario's mom after this, uh, in town. Um, like, if you have very short clothing, it, it, it highlights certain features of, uh, the body, uh, and because of that, that will, uh, obviously, you know, draw your eye to her, and it, it, it's kind of, it's, it's sex appeal, it's, it's, you know, selling sex, essentially. Um, and so, in terms of design, does it work? Yeah, it would, it would work, and I didn't, uh, I forgot to show this, was you can get a Super Shroom in one of those crates. Um, yeah, it works, but do I think it's, do I think it works as well as some people think? Like, I don't think it works in terms, it depends on the game. Again, I think in Tomb Raider, it kind of works, but I don't know. You know, uh, I mean, like, in terms of, like, Ivy, personally, uh, she, to me, I don't think I would, I don't know, I, I don't really, f I, do, I mean, A, me, in terms of my personal opinion, I wouldn't buy a game based on character design, personally. Do I think other people would? I don't, I, I, I don't think so. Again, I guess I think the one example that it would actually be really important would be Tomb Raider. Uh, that's the only one I can actually think of, if anything. Other than that, I don't think it really... I, I think sometimes they just do it because they, they think, you know... 
They, they just they did a lot of people who design games and a lot of people who play games are men and of course they wanted to make women look a certain way because um, they're going to uh, because they want to you know they want to get men's attention with the sex appeal and highlighting certain uh, features that's what they want to do and you know if, if women were designing games would they necessarily necessarily do that probably not would they necessarily you know have certain kinds of clothing I mean I guess my opinion is it doesn't personally bother me all that much, but I don't really find it that necessarily in terms of like my personal opinion. Like, I don't really think it matters whether or not uh, uh, her dress is very revealing or not. Um, I, I mean, like, if it was really revealing or if it was very like not revealing, would it make a difference to me either way? No, I wouldn't really care either way. However, I guess um, I guess I would personally prefer them to have you know not be all skimpily dressed just because you know it, 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 it does kind of get like old and it's also kind of to an extent it's offensive though then again um sometimes our whole nation in general just needs to offending people is almost too much of an issue but i would say overall i i don't think that it's necessarily it's necessary i don't think it's necessary necessary to design uh characters like that um i don't know how much that it would actually help uh, in uh, selling people, selling games, but I don't think it's enough to know that a lot of female characters are dressed that way. Um, but, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I, I personally would say, personally, I would say I don't mind it in some characters, but, like, if there was just every female character in existence was dressed like that, um, that's like saying every, if every female character was dressed like Peach, I wouldn't really care for that either. Uh, because I don't really care for, like, I, I like, I like variation. Now, yeah, I, I would say with Ivy and other characters, like, they're almost way underdressed. Uh, but, I don't know. I, I, don't, I would have to say, personally, it doesn't bother me all that much. And here I'm showing some of the uh, where to find some of the super blocks and Toad Town sewers, and also um, some of the partner upgrade moves. And Ballast Move is actually quite good. Fan Smack. But yeah, um, I hope that uh, the rank kind of uh, satisfies you upon the grade. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know. That, my personal opinion is, again, personally, it doesn't bother me that much. I see where you're coming from. Um, and, but in terms of design, uh, it does make sense if you're trying to sell sex to do that because of how you're highlighting certain areas of the body um, by doing that. So in terms of design, it would work. I don't think it would. It actually sells that much. But yeah, I'm going to stop because I'm kind of going in circles a little bit.